Hey, have you worked with AEM before? Yes, I have. It's a complex system with many components and features. Definitely, did you know that OSGI components can be conditionally activated based on configurations or other criteria in AEM? That's interesting. How can logging be configured programmatically in AEM? Logging in AEM can be configured programmatically by interacting with the Sling Logging Logger configuration. Interesting. How can custom OSGI service properties be created and managed in AEM? Custom OSGI service properties can be created using that property annotation in your component or service class. What are common practices for ensuring OSGI components and services are properly decoupled in AEM? Ensuring proper decoupling involves interface segregation, dependency injection, configuration abstraction, and event-driven architecture. How can OSGI services be secured to ensure only authorized components can access them? Security can be enhanced by using service properties, service ranking, and ACLs, access control lists. What strategies can be used for versioning OSGI services and managing backward compatibility? Strategies include semantic versioning, version annotations, and adapter patterns. How can OSGI bundle dependencies be managed and resolved in AEM? Bundle dependencies can be managed and resolved by using manifest headers, OSGI resolver, and manual resolution, 